your story in your head, or my head in this case, is what creates reality. This is kind of a bold assertion, but we're going to verify this in one moment. I'd like you to start asking yourself, what's the story that goes on in your head right now as we speak? Your story could be, okay, I'm watching this guy, he's kind of weird, let's see what's happening. But you need to really pay attention to the story of your life in that situation. Are you sitting here and watching because you want to be more successful or perhaps you're searching for something, searching for enlightenment, searching for business success, or maybe, just maybe, you're just watching this because you believe, oh, I'm just a fucking retard, I just do whatever the fuck I want, I don't really, I'm lazy, this is interesting, so I'm just gonna listen to him. But what I want you to start noticing and verifying for yourself, again, don't listen to anything I say and take it for granted, check it for yourself, you'll start seeing that every single story that you have in your head regarding your life is exactly the way that your life is looking right now. So what I urge you to do is start changing the story that you have for yourself. Let's say you want to become successful. Notice that this story is cool. It means you'll find people who will help you become successful. It means that you're going to build up. But try changing the story to I'm successful already or I'm already, I already have everything I need. And you'll see how suddenly instead of looking for opportunities for mentors and people to help you, for, you know, building up, because again, that's part of the story, you're going to start seeing all sorts of opportunities for success that actually reinforce what you believe about yourself right now, which is that you are successful. You can actually try that with anything um, that you want. You can do that with uh, being positive, uh, you know, changing your outlook about life, about money, about relationships. This is, uh, this is really cool. This is something that I urge you to try also urge you to write down your uh, life story right now on a piece of paper or you know on the computer and just look at how whatever you write your beliefs about yourself your life story you know where am I right now and where am I trying to go to you're gonna see that these two stories are basically a direct mirroring of your life situation this begs the question, does my life situation come from my uh, uh, inner story or does my story create my life situation? Now, what I personally uh, have found is that when you change the life story, what goes on inside, everything outside starts changing as well. So again, you should try this right now. Take a piece of paper or just write down on your computer the way that your life is looking right now how you believe your life is right now, where you believe your life is going right now, and try completely rewriting the story, but in a way that makes sense to you, where you can kind of skip steps. Now, this is called leapfrog theory. This theory is from a book called Winning by Intimidation. It's kind of a uh, very old book, but it's still relevant today. And what leapfrog theory means is that whatever you want to become, let's say you want to be an NBA player, you can be an NBA player without going through the whole way up. You can be a millionaire without first making 10,000 and 100,000. And you can date the hottest girl without first dating hotter and hotter girls. Because uh, leapfrog theory says that if you only qualify as good enough for where, whatever level you want to get to, you're already going to be able to be there. So let's say you're good enough for the NBA, you can already jump for the NBA and just try applying there. Let's say you want to be a millionaire and you already have certain skills which you believe can generate millions. You don't actually have to go through the whole process of first charging $100, then $1,000, then $10,000. You can actually jump to the millions already. So this is a really cool concept. Again, it goes hand to hand, leapfrog theory. You can read about it in Winning by Intimidation and also how your life story, the current story that you're telling yourself, and by the way, your environment tells you a life story, the people around you reinforce the life story, start getting fucking aware of that because you're gonna see where you are right now and where you're trying to go. And again, everything is an illusion. So let's say right now, you believe that you're not successful and you're trying to go to being successful, you're in a story that traps you in being the underdog. 
start changing your thoughts to view yourself as successful already and you're going to see how reality starts changing and treating you differently. Till next time, peace.